everybody, it's Wendy here and I'm part of the family at Causeway Coast Vineyard. I hope you're all keeping so well. We're doing a bit of craft together today and before we begin I just want to show you what I have for you on our website. I've got your colouring page and it's Daniel today because Emily and her family told us the story of Daniel and it was so much fun. Oh, do you hear the dog? Here's hoping he stops. Okay, we'll keep going. So this is, you can print this out on the website and um, that's on our Together at Home page in the kids section if you want to colour in. And because we're doing Daniel, I thought what we're going to do today is we're going to make lion's masks. Rawr. Do you like my lion's mask? <laughs> like I've got a droppy bit here. So we're going to be making these together today and I'm going to show you what we need to do. So here goes, we'll pop this down over here. What we need is a paper plate. I've already cut the inside out of this and you might want to get a little bit of help with that because it can be a bit tricky. So do that, just watch your fingers. We need scissors, we need glue, we need some sellotape. We need a couple of lolly sticks because they hold the mask up for you. And then what I've done is I've cut some strips of paper just in different colors for the lion's mane. So I've got some browns, yellows, oranges, um, and I just cut strips and then they make the mane and then all I've done is out of the brown paper just cut a couple of ears just some oval round whatever shapes you want to do uh, and the other thing I have is a pen and that's just to curl the edges of the mane and I'll show you all of that in a little minute so I think that's me have we got everything will we get started okay let's do it so we cut the center out like I said from your paper plate get somebody to help you with that what I'm going to do is I'm just going to pop some glue right around that top edge because that just helps everything stick well. And then all we're doing is we're taking a bit at a time um, some of our strips, a strip at a time, and we're just going to work our way around the edge. So whatever colours you like, I'm just going to mix them up a bit. Do you think we're going to be scary lions or we're going to be fun lions? I think I might like to be a fun lion. I'm sticky already. My fingers are sticky. And I'm only started. Right, hold on. I'm going to hold this up. There. This is the start. Okay, so you can see that we're just layering them right around the edge of our mask. I'll keep going. Some brown. You can do it in whatever order you want. Now, if you don't have coloured paper, like lion's mane's colours, you could just get some white paper and colour it in. Or if you've got other coloured paper, you could just have a different coloured line. That might be fun, mightn't it? Just whatever you think you fancy doing. And you just put your glue just on that bottom edge and then stick it down. You don't need, you don't need an awful lot of glue just on the bottom edge. There we go. Do you want to see again? Halfway there. Let's see. I think I'm going to put a brown one in. No. Do another this. Quite like this colour. Like a goldy yellow, isn't it? I've just got a mixture of paper and card here because again it's just what I had in the box. My craft box. Are you all having a nice summer? Are you getting to enjoy time off? I'm loving it. Now let's see, I think we'll do another brown and then I'll show you in a minute again. I think I've put more on this one. Let's do a little bit of this lemon. This is a very colourful line. Yeah, I've definitely more strips on this one. We're layering here. <laughs> is yours looking good? Right, last one. For me. Down here. Oh, okay, I'm going to show you this. I'll pop the lid on. We go. That's our lion's mane nearly done. Oh, I need to get my ears on. Forgot my ears. Okay, need the glue back again. It's a 
Again, we're just going to put glue on the bottom, air shelf up. And let's see, we'll do here. And then one on this side. I wonder, can you see these if I hold them up for you? Can you see the ears? Hello! Okay, so we're going to turn it over, okay? And we'll push down on all of these bits of paper and card just to make sure they're well stuck down. And we're going to take, I have two lolly sticks. You could do one, two, or I don't know, you could use something else. Just something to hold it so that you can hold the, hold the mask in place. And I'm just going to sellotape these on. I thought two, oh, that's too long. I thought two might make it a little bit stronger. And I'm just going to put plenty of sellotape on it just to keep them in place. Put a little bit around the edge. That should be enough to hold it in place. There we go. I'm just taking it around. Okay, can you see that? So I just tape them on there. Okay. And then the other thing that I'm going to do is just curl the edges, and that's why I have my pen. So all you do is take your pen and you roll it. Wait and see. Maybe I'll hold it up and let you see. So if you take a strip. And take your pen and put it there and then you just roll the bit of card or paper around your pen and look it curls. So I'll do a few. You can work your way right the way round. I'll just do a few to let you see what, what it could look like. There we go. Roll it right the way round. You can make some really curly with you see. On the card if you go it right down it makes it really curly. Look! Isn't that good? I'll do a couple this side and then I'll maybe not do them at all. Oh, we could be here for ages. Let's do this. Roll that one round and one down here. Isn't that fun? And you get a curly line saying, okay, right here goes. Don't be scared. Rawr. <laughs> I hope you have fun making your lines, man. They're quite cute, aren't they? And have a really great rest of day and look after yourselves and hopefully I'll see you all again soon. Take care everybody. Bye-bye.